Hello, everybody. Trebek here, alongside with Robbie once again. Hello, hello. Okay, so this week we're going to be taking on a uh, sort of different champion. It's always a different champion, but the style of this one's a little different. Uh, she's been requested a couple times, so I think she'll be fun to do. We're going to be doing a champion called Oriana. Oriana. I'm going to let you listen to a sound file of her, and maybe you'll get the reference of this character. Maybe you won't. We'll see. What? Okay. Okay. Are you familiar with the Portal series? <laughs> okay. No, I did. Do you I, know the Portal series? My roommates. Are your roommates? Play it. Yeah. They yeah, got yeah. like that crazy character girl. I've never. I've never. Gladys. No, I've never like seen it. Well, there's a character the that has like pretty much that voice. I just the watched them like spend so much time on that thing. But you don't know that you're not familiar with the voice. No, like I never. Oh, I just okay. would like. I just. I wanted to see if you knew the game Portal. But um, you kind of do and you kind of don't. Anyways, it's a very popular voice in the game. Okay. Uh, it has like a weird sense of humor and, and whatever. It really has nothing to do with the way she looks or anything. <laughs> it's just, just the voice. But it does tell you one thing, and that's that she is a robot thing. No? You can get yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Um, she's not like a weird robot thing. Like She's like a human shape. Yeah. But she's like, like, like you know, like uh, Star Wars, like... Okay, like C three PO kind of C three PO type thing, like blah yeah. blah blah, whatever that guy is. Okay. Uh, don't don't take any reference of how she looks from that. But I'm saying yeah. robot like that can talk like a robot. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So uh, let's talk about the way she looks. So her color scheme is between silver and gold. I don't know if yeah. color scheme really helps, but it, sure. it, for me, I don't know. Yeah. It's kind of integral for her. So she's got like a robot face. Okay. And her hair is. There's hair, but it's like robot. Like it's it doesn't move. I'm assuming, but it's just like hair and a little bun at the top. But it's like it's metal. Okay. Uh, it's yeah, just the way yeah, that her yeah. character is. So she's split up into two parts. She's got her body, you know, basically robot body with even even a little windy thing at the back, like a you know those things that you wind oh, up. Oh yeah, and yeah, like, yeah. Clap, clap. Like yeah, yeah. Monkey. Okay. She has like one of those in her back. She's like the lady of clockwork type thing. So she has like a bit of clockwork to her. Okay. Robot clockworkness of her. She's split up in half. Right. Because, like, her upper half, like, floats a little, and then her bottom half, like, they're separated. Just separated sure. body. Yeah. Right? Okay. Um, very slim body with, like, slim. Yeah, very slim robot body. It's almost like you're grabbing R2D2, or not R2D2, but C3PO. C3PO, and, like, splitting his body and making it float and making him a girl. And making, but is I don't it, know. like. I don't, like. I don't know if I'm allowed to ask you questions. Ask me questions. Okay. Yes. So is it kind of, when you say like clockwork, is it sort of geary or is it more like streamlined metal, you know? Like is it, um, or is it a mixture of both? It's I sort guess? of a mixture. Like there's gears. Because I don't want to go like too like one But I wouldn't way. go, I wouldn't go too much into gears. To be honest, just more metal. Yeah. Yeah. I just know, just her name is like the lady of clockwork. Cool. But I mean, I don't see too much clockwork. So continuing, she's got like I don't know if it's like a metal skirt or something as well. Okay. But like yeah, yeah just like a metal girl. But there's one major detail I haven't mentioned yet, and that is her uh, companion. It's it's a ball. That's okay. pretty much it. It's a metal ball. Yeah. It has like a lens eye in the middle type thing, you know, that like I don't know can move or whatever. Right. Yeah. Right. Like. Um, move up and downwards so there's sort of like i guess a track in the middle i don't know yeah okay, it's just okay yeah. it's just a ball and uh, in the game she basically her moves are manipulated around the ball she does very little it's the ball that moves around and does stuff oh, okay so there's her and then there's like a sort of basketball beach ball <laughs> sized thing okay like i don't want you drawing like a little tiny thing or something that's three times bigger than her right. it's like roughly the size of a in the middle of basketball beach ball Cool. Size. And it's the same thing. It's metal, gold, and metal, and maybe some clockwork in there. Probably not. But but that like ball thing can float on its own. Yeah, it's not it floats like on its own. It's separated from her. She like I guess she controls it somehow. Or okay. Whatever. Yeah. Like it's not like she like throws it. No. No. Okay. She doesn't cool. throw a ball. <laughs> it's a floating ball with lens. It, it probably has its own mind, but I'm not right. sure how okay. they do it. So uh, I think that's I think that's it for her. So you're basically. I'm interested to see how this is. Oh, uh, be cool. I mean, she's got like, 
She doesn't have like an open mouth or anything. She's got glowing eyes. I don't know. Like, like, like once again, like Star Wars type thing. She does have an open mouth. She doesn't. Okay. She doesn't. Okay, when okay, she okay. talks, it's like it just goes through. Right. Yeah. Right. Like a robot. Um. Oh, you know what actually might help a little, sort of like the way that she stands and stuff, like sort of like the way a ballerina would stand, like that, like very, that very like stiff standing. Yeah, she yeah. might even be sort of on a tippy toe. Okay. So like maybe when you consider drawing her, kind of like throw that in. Actually, I think that's probably a thing about her. Looking at it now, and <laughs> thinking of the way that she walks in the game, a, a metal ballerina thing. Cool. The oh, skirt. and then, then the skirt, right? Yeah, that, like it's a little bit of a skirt. And the and bun hair, that makes and sense. And the bun hair. I guess it makes sense. And the wind-up toy thing, that's like... I learned something. That's I like, never knew about the character. That's like Nutcracker kind of stuff. Pretty it? much, pretty much. Cool. Okay, good Just, luck. <laughs> all right, cool. <laughs> okay, everybody, we're back. Uh, Robbie has finished up his drawing of Oriana. I'm gonna show him the splash right and he's gonna show me his drawing. I'm also gonna show him uh, another skin just to show him like the one part that you can't see in the splash art because of the ball. So we're ready to swap. Okay, three, two, one, go. Yep, oh, pretty much. Okay, yeah. Cool. Cool enough. Okay, let's take a look here. What do we got? I didn't do the bangs. You didn't do the bangs? Yeah, I didn't I didn't go into bangs. Okay, I there, like, there's this hair down. I fun. see I was trying to figure out how the clock stuff fit in but now i see it like in the in the little orb thing yeah, yeah. like the, it's more of like kind of like globish mine i just kind of went more just like yeah. futuristic metallic whereas there's okay yeah, makes sense. looking into it i'm seeing a couple of things that i really like um one one of the coolest things I've, i just noticed now is like the hidden gears on the side of her body there? Yeah, that was the only thing I was like... Like, that was the interior of That her? I just sort of threw in. Here's, I was like, by the way, another image where you can see more of, like, her separated body. Oh, right, yeah. Like, this is a skin. So, like, yeah. you see how her okay. is different and all that. But definitely, like, I should have done more with the clock stuff. And then yeah. the arms and the hands are similar. And I, I don't want people to be like, oh, he's definitely seen it before. But they it's just are, because like, you have the joint, the ball. Yeah, exactly. The ball joints. But it, it's just like... When I was drawing it too, I was like, this kind of, it's, I figured it'd be that way. It's sort of similar to those like almost wooden human uh, things that you get like at art stores to like yeah, yeah. do poses. Like I, I kind of thought it'd be that way. Now, uh, and then like, I was going to say, is it for, is that magnets or something? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm like, I feel like your middle part, you actually made like the yeah. functionality of it. I tried to think of like how it was floating in between. I have at no first, idea why it's At first it was going to be some sort of plasma -y thing, but then... It's literally not floating by anything in, in, in hers. Yeah. It's I, I, I don't know. I just figured magnets, but then I think I, I went a little too much with the... It, it's like iRobot kind of like super futuristic-y, whereas theirs is like metal. Like it's like theirs yeah. is worn out, right? Like and it's yeah, I guess. It's a little more yeah. jagged and like uh, clockish. I don't know. Whatever. I, I think it's cool. I think it's good. You made her like she looks sort of uh, bigger, she, like older, taller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's, she looks like she'd be like tall, like a big tall lady. Yeah, exactly. And her ball, you, yeah, the ball you did, the ball. I mean, like yeah, big lens and yeah, that's the ball. <laughs> cool. Uh, whatever. Yeah, that's cool. I like it. I mean, yeah, no, definitely, it's close. It's. It's different, and it's awesome, and you made her chest pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> I heard they wanted boobs, so I, I did some. <laughs> so we got we got his uh, his, skill, his skills really showing there. Okay. Cool. Awesome drawing. Thank Thanks. you very much. Okay, right. guys. Uh, we'll see you next time. See ya.